Okay kids, here's our potato. We're gonna make an electrochemical battery out of it. We're gonna stick a copper wire in this end and a zinc coated wire in this end and the flow of electrons from the copper to the zinc's gonna run our digital clock. These are our potatoes. The common white, or as they call them in Africa, the Irish potato. Potatoes first came from the Incas in Peru in South America. They sun dried them out in the mountainsides and they had over 3,000 varieties of them. Now, to make an electrochemical battery, we're going to take two common household variety potatoes, battery clips, a digital clock, so that we can show that it works. We need some copper wire, we need some galvanised wire or galvanised nails. They've got zinc in them. Potatoes are really good for you. You can bake it, you can fry it, you can boil it, you can mash it, and it's great for developing countries because they can grow them all over the world. From South America, Africa, Asia, heck, we've even got them in Australia. Now we're ready to make our electrochemical battery. And we started out with some battery clips and we've hooked our bits of wire on them so that we can put these into the potatoes and join them to our clock. You're going to put in zinc covered wire in this end, in one end, we're going to put copper wire in. Same with the other battery, copper wire in one end, and this time we're going to use a zinc nail just in there. Now our battery's halfway there, and we're going to connect this end across to here from the copper to the zinc. Now we're going to connect our clock. So we put our positive over here, and then we bring the negative wire across to here. And there we go. We've got our digital clock running on two batteries. And that's amazing.